Hello guys. Uh, today uh, I have some very special things uh, stuff. This is a Nebula projector. They call the Pocket Cinema. You can watch Netflix. You can watch TV. You can watch everything, everything by this one, by the Nebula projector. Uh, I buy this. Uh, it's about 349 uh, euro. The first problem I find in Nebula is they it's not unlocked the Nebula Google Play service. The problem is some application in Nebula they are need Google Play service. That's my problem. So therefore, uh, I'm looking for how to fix this but I'm not stop from that I'm looking for the information in every forum every place in the internet about how to figure out or how to fix this with the Google Play service after looking for everywhere for fix my nebula about Google service I find some very nice forum they're talking about how to fix the Google service in nebula and they say I must contact the support center for get special passport for getting update but that is better and that is very good news for me so I immediately contact the customer service Nebula and about two days they uh, they answer it they give me special password for upgrade of the software this is include the uh, Google Play service and etc etc after I am a lot of talking, so we going to the how to upgrade it. Let's check it out. Okay, uh, now we going to how to upgrade Nebula in beta. Yes, first you must check it out your battery in one hundred percent or or is better you connecting to the power supply, and then uh, let's the Wi-Fi connecting and etc etc. Yes, and you going to the setting. You're going to the about you're going to the Android version and you can press it five times uh, click one two three four five and this is will be input the password there so you can use the password I will be give you in the commenter and then they will be going to the uh, software updater and then Blah, and then you waiting for about 45 minutes and then now is ready and now my software is you see we have and I already have a, a Play Store and Google Play service in it and then when you see in the uh, in the here when you see in here you see my Android version uh, the chef, uh, the system version is Enbu E1 KMS or something like that <laughs> Yeah, now it's change it a version. So I hope this is can help. But the software is beta because the support center from Nebula say this is beta only for testing. So maybe still have bugs, maybe still have uh, uh, something error from that. But until now, I'm not yet find that the problem from the new software in Nebula. But this is the best uh, solution for fix the issues about Google service, play service or something like that. Now I can enjoy my watching TV by the Nebula with the NLZ because before NLZ did a Google Play service for run it. And now I can also download more games for that but only for, yeah, because the Beamer is not designed for a play game so you cannot download you can download game from Google Play or something but the problem is the projector not not uh, they make it not for the playing game so uh, for me is when you want to play in game like Xbox or uh, uh, PlayStation in Nebula you can also in, uh, put it in the HDMI socket they have it there please and thank you for watching this and I hope uh, because my English is not so good I just only try to explain something to you but uh, the, the more information you can contact Nebula Sport or I will be give also some de description below about the password of the download. So I hope it's helping full for people with the problem same like me. And then I'm Alan Kurniawan and thank you for watching video and don't forget for subscribes. And 
like the, this video when you like this when this video is helpful for you so you can like it you can like or share to your friend there so i hope this video help for peoples in the world <laughs> okay my name is alan kurniawan ciao